Word for today. Your disadvantage can work for your advantage. Although it seems like the arts are against you, surely, surely, God is going to use the disadvantage to give you the upper hand. What was supposed to take you out, what was supposed to destroy you, what was supposed to defeat you, what was supposed to humiliate you or ruin you, ruin your image, it will actually work to your advantage. Even in exhaustion, still have expectation. I'm going to say that one more time. Even in exhaustion, still have expectation. Have the expectation that God will defend you. Have the expectation that God will uphold you. Have the expectation that God will deliver you. Have the expectation that God is fighting on your behalf. God is moving on your behalf. Have the expectation that God will vindicate you. Have expectation today. Your dry places are turning into an overflowing river of hope, recovery, expectation, favor, blessings, abundance, and increase. Your ability to maintain your character under pressure has gotten God's attention. God is watching. He sees how you handle yourself in the midst of opposition. God is watching. Your resilience has caught the attention of those who tried to set you up, who laid traps along the way for you, who did stuff to trip you up, to get you in trouble. Surely, God, (laughs) surely God makes you stronger when you endure these types of things, when you endure the process of your disadvantage. Surely the joy of the Lord is your strength. So continue to smile, continue to hold your head up, continue to be encouraged, continue to keep pressing, continue to move forward in spite of what's going on around you. Be encouraged and hold to your faith knowing that God is working it out on your behalf. You may have to go through some stuff and suffer a little while, but God is working on your behalf. And in the end, God will give you more than what you think that you have lost. He will give you more. He'll give you increase. He'll give you a better job. He'll give you a better salary. He'll give you more joy, more peace. So rest in the peace of God. Continue to trust God. Continue to look unto the hills from which cometh your help. For your help coming from the Lord. Continue to trust God. Continue to be faithful. Continue to be prayerful. And rest in the peace of God. For surely, surely it will work out in your favor.